Hello, this is Mark Sherman from CERT Division with your SEI Cyber Minute. Automation, with its natural successor, autonomy, increasingly depends on software for successful operations. This is especially true for the Department of Defense, where new systems can contain tens of millions of lines of software. Unfortunately, where there is software, there are risks from vulnerabilities. In response, the Department of Defense has recently expanded the key document governing acquisition, Instruction 5002, with a chapter called Enclosure 14, Cybersecurity in the Defense Acquisition System. Enclosure 14 identifies some of the malicious activities to consider in defense acquisition, such as adversaries getting data to compromise or disrupt missions, adversaries getting IP and technical information to diminish DOD advantage, adversaries inserting compromised software or hardware into systems, or adversaries subverting or compromising networks, systems, support infrastructure, and even employees. To address the need for cybersecurity, appropriate requirements are needed throughout the acquisition lifecycle, from initial concept through sustainment and disposal. Program managers are becoming responsible for cybersecurity for their programs. An infrastructure of subject matter experts in cybersecurity support program managers to meet their cybersecurity needs. This infrastructure is being populated throughout the Department of Defense, supported by educational organizations, such as the Defense Acquisition University, and FFRDCs, such as the FBI. The dependency of modern systems on software has raised the importance of cybersecurity in the acquisition process. Enclosure 14 describes one set of the actions that can improve our cybersecurity posture. Thanks for watching this SCI Cyber Minute. For more information, please visit our website or send me an email at info at sei.cmu.edu.